millions of hits online, so it must be funny, right? So what exactly is humor? Humor is a part of life. Without it, life would be too sad. I mean, life is full of very sad moments and situations, and I think it's the easiest way to approach life. Humor makes life easier and improves it. I think it's important because it brings people together. Even though humor is so important in life, it's only been the subject of serious scientific research during the past 30 years. Willibald Ruch, a professor at the University of Zurich, is the most important scientist in the field within the German-speaking world. So we asked him, what is humor? Humor is an individual characteristic. Research shows that humor provides information on character, personality, attitudes, values and worldviews. Through humor, you can get to know other people and know what kind of person they are. In the Middle Ages, humor was a medical term. From the different mixture of body fluids, that is, the different humors, a temperament would arise, from melancholic to sanguine. Over time, humor came to be seen as a skill, and even a philosophical worldview. Research shows us that all humans come into the world with the ability to be humorous. And what about Swiss humor? He was a serverless sausage, and he hated being a serverless sausage. He didn't want to be a serverless sausage. He would have much rather been a bratwurst sausage or meatloaf. The serverless sausage had enough of being a serverless sausage and decided to end it all. It went out and threw itself on the pavement in front of the next passing dog. Is this self-tormented sausage typically Swiss? Scientific research on the matter says no. There is no country-specific humor. The only areas that are off-limits to humor are affected by culture. Where there are differences between cultures is not the ability to be funny, but rather how often humor is used and on what occasion. Culture also influences what should be humor-free. Thus, for example, can we laugh in church or not? In our society, the answer is pretty clear. There are traditions and social rules, and there are other subjects that vary across cultures. Research also found out that humor can be helpful in practical situations. For example, with the fear of flying. Humor can counteract other emotions. This has been shown through behavioral therapy, too. I can reduce emotions like anger, or in this case fear, through the use of humor. The effect of humor on the body works in the opposite direction. When experiencing humor, you're more relaxed, muscles are looser. When experiencing fear, the body is tense. The two work against each other. Scientific research on the matter continues. Humor is a part of human existence, but there's still a lot to discover.